Hey there, Sagittarius. This is Renee, and welcome back. Sag, this is your reading, and today we're going to do something a little bit different. We're going to take a look at all about romance. You know, what's going on in Sag's love life, what's happening, what's coming forward, what you can expect, right? So let's take a look. Let's get some energy for Sagittarius. What's going on in Sagittarius's love life? If this resonates, like and subscribe. If it doesn't, feel free to take a look at your other placements. And let's get into it. Okay. So we have, keep an open mind. Your soulmate may be different from your usual type or expectation. Right? And we have heart-to-heart -heart conversations. Honestly discuss your feelings with each other. So this may be someone that you are not usual. Not your usual type. Not someone that you really see yourself being attracted to. I feel like this person is kind of surprising you. Because I feel like your conversation is opening up, you know, new perspectives on the way you view love. The way you look at things. I feel like this person is pulling on your heartstrings with their conversation. Right? Um, so let's take a look at some more energy for Sagittarius. Hmm. Let's take a look at some more energy for Sag. Okay. We have Angel Therapy. Archangel Raphael. Give your cares and worries to us angels and allow us to take your burdens. Okay. So let your angels do the work here. Right? And you have gifts from God. Archangel uh, Sandalphon. We angels bring you gifts from your creator. Open your arms to receive. Wow. Okay. Angel therapy. So there's some kind of gift coming in for you. I feel like your angels are blessing you right now, Sag. Um, so you may feel really uplifted um, during this time. You may be really um, kind of anticipating the best out of the situation because I feel like your angels are providing you with protection, guidance, and gifts, right? So beautiful. Let's take a look at some more energy for Sagittarius. Okay, we have Observer. So you may have been watching this person or this person may have been watching you for a while. You have the number 49, so that may be significant. And we have peace, the number 23. So I, I feel like, yeah, this person's been watching you. They see your calmness. They, they feel like you're very serene. Like they're really attracted to the way that you carry yourself, the way that you go about your day, you know. Um, very interesting. Let's get some love oracles for Sagittarius. Let's see what's going on in love. What other messages do we have for Sag? What's going on in love for Sag and this person? You know, I'm feeling a very peaceful vibe with this relationship. Very peaceful vibe, right? Let's see, we have, yeah, we have sunglasses. Someone's watching you. Yeah, they're watching you. They're kind of maybe looking at your social media, looking at the situation. We have the hammer. Uh, so this may be a situation that you're working on. There's a lot of conversation. There's a lot of friendship maybe happening. This could be a situation to where you're friends before lovers kind of situation. Um, but I feel like, you know, there's a lot of conversation going on here. I feel like you're really getting to know each other. You're really trying to um, give this new situation a chance, okay? I feel like you're both kind of working at it. You know, I feel like you really want it to work out because the vibe that you give each other. There's just this peaceful vibe, like it's calm, it's serene, it's just, it kind of just fits, right? So let's get some romantic tarot, let's see what's going on with Sagittarius. Messages for Sagittarius, please. 
Okay, the six of emotion. Definitely, there's a lot of gifts coming your way, Sag. Um, and like I said, I was feeling like this may be a situation to where you're friends before lovers. So, the, and I feel like this is where that Six of Cups comes in at, you know, because you're building this relationship as friends first, and I feel like it escalates. It just moves to the next level, okay? Memories can fill your heart with many emotions. It's important to remember your past accurately without seeing it as better or worse than it was. People you used to know may return to your life unexpectedly. Children could be a, an important issue, or you may need to reconnect with your own inner child, right? And we have the Eight of Emotions. So this is the Eight of Cups. So, so there may be some kind of emotions that you may be releasing at the moment. There may be something that you're walking away from. Uh, but you feel a deep longing for something meaningful in your life. In your heart, you know that there's more out there waiting for you in the world. It may be time to switch careers, move to a new home or city, or initiate other important changes. Do what's right for you and seek out your magical new life. So definitely something new coming in, right? We also have the Ten of Action. So this is the Ten of Wands energy. So you may be really busy at the moment, have a lot of priorities, you know, have a lot of weight that you're carrying. Um, but you're working too hard. The angels are asking you to find a healthy balance between your career and your personal life. So be willing to ask for help in order to lighten your load so that you can take better care of yourself. Straining to make others happy can be harmful to your health. Okay? And one more. We have the Ace of Emotion. This is the Ace of Cups energy. So definitely a new beginning and a new offer coming your way. This is going to be something that's very wonderful for you. You know, this cherub is, an, is announcing that a wonderful new emotional experience is coming into your life. You may meet someone new who makes your heart flutter, or your current relationship will experience a reawakening. It's also possible, excuse me, it's also possible that your intuitive abilities will be greatly increased by your open heart. Okay? We'll move that right here in the middle. Okay. So beautiful energy. You know, at the bottom we have organization. So your plans are on target and everything will flow more smoothly if you add a little organization and discipline to your methods. The key to success is to allow, allow your creativity to be greatly guided by logic. Be open to asking for help from someone very intellectual and seek out a mentor. Okay, so definitely a change is coming forward for you. You definitely need to, you know, kind of think things through, make plans. Um, but I feel like a lot of things are happening. You're in for a change. Okay, Sag. So let's take a look at some messages. Let's see what's going on with Sagittarius's person. Messages from your, your person, please. I love you. Yeah, that's this. Ace of Cups energy. You know, I love you. They, this, these, this is escalating. Okay. I knew exactly what I was doing. You know, so this person knows where they're going in this relationship. They have plans, right? Just being near you is intoxicating. I feel like they think about you a lot. Sometimes I stay awake <laughs> thinking about you. Definitely. I'm loving this. I wish I could share my good news with you. Right? I feel like they have something planned. They have something that they want to offer you, but they're keeping it a surprise. They're waiting. They're waiting to tell you. But I feel like this person has plans. And, you know, it's going to come out pretty soon what this surprise is. You know what they really want to tell you. You know, but I feel like they're holding it close to them. They're protecting it right now. Okay, more messages from this person in Sagittarius's life. 
more messages for this person, please. Okay. The way I have treated you was wrong. Okay. So I feel like, you know, this person feels like they can treat you better. I long for your kiss. This person, you know, what I'm getting is I feel like this person wants so much more for you, Sagittarius. They they will really want to provide the things that you really want or need, right? And we have you you've triggered me. Okay? Will you leave me like the others? So this person has been hurt in the past. Wow. And we also have drugs and alcohol. So there might have been some kind of addiction. Maybe you are this person. Yeah, they have hurt me. Wow. So yeah, I feel like there's some things in this person's past that um, really hurt them in the past. And they're kind of fearful that this situation may end up the same way. Um, but I feel like you know, this person is really open to making things change. There's a lot of change going on here. And I feel like you bring this peace to this person's life. You make this person feel at ease, you know, like you're very easy to talk to. You're very easy to communicate with. Okay, definitely. Okay. So let's go ahead and take a look at some handmade cards. Let's get some more messages for Sagittarius. See if we can look into more of this connection. Give more messages for this connection, please. Give me messages for Sagittarius. What's going on in this connection? Tell me more about this person spirit. Tell me more about this person for Sagittarius. Okay. Okay, so you or this person may have a new job. Okay, and uh, they're saying you already know the answer. That they were not the win. See, you are limitless. Yeah, someone's wearing a mask. Someone really doesn't want to know. Someone doesn't want you to know how deep their feelings really go. You know, so I feel like they may be putting on some kind of act to maybe act like they are not as interested as they really are right um but i feel like they may have seen you with somebody and it may have really hurt their feelings you know because i feel like they they're saying that they're happiest with you you know um but they're trying to process their fears so that they can come back so that they'll be more healthy because they feel like this new start they want with you you know um yeah, they have they have issues with the past relationship, but they're currently going through transformation and changes. So they're definitely trying to change their situation, right? Um, but they want you to be aware of what went on in their past, and they want to just go with the flow in the situation. But they may have felt like you pushed push yourself away because of something that may maybe you heard or maybe you overheard you know I, I feel like they they kind of feel some kind of distance right let's get some tarot let's see what's going on with this person more messages for this person please more messages for this person Yeah, look at this. 1111, the Four of Wands. This person wants to be committed. But this person has been betrayed. You know, and now, you know, either you betrayed them or they betrayed you. But this person really feels like 
you know, nothing is worth as much as you are. Like, you're what they think about. You're on their mind. They have this um, commitment issue that they're dealing with, but I feel like they want to move forward for you with an offer of commitment, of um, kind of, um, oh my goodness, I'm losing my train of thought here. Moving to the next level. Thank you, Spirit. Thank you. Because I'm like brain dead right now, right? And we have the King of Cups. So definitely they want to give you their cup of love. They want to bring you some love. I feel like this person is very sensitive. This person is very loving and caring. They, they, may, they may be really trying to control their emotions, but I feel like they aren't even aware that their emotions are just pouring out. They're pouring forward. You know, I feel like they're trying to control their emotions. They want to take more control of the situation, but I feel like they can't. Because um, they're stuck on you, Sagittarius. They want to win your heart at any means necessary. You know, they're willing to go the distance. They're willing to do whatever it takes to let you see that they're offering you this cup of love. That they're offering you this commitment, right? With this Knight of Cups energy. And all they want to do is, you know, make you happy bring you peace of mind, bring you a more relaxed way of life, you know? And I feel like they're focused on that. They're ready to, you know, just let you see. You know, they want the plane to stop, you know? I've finished with this life, now I want to move on to this commitment. You know, whatever I've done in the past is done and over with. You know, please listen to what I have to say now. My emotions are pouring out to you. I'm giving you this offer, this cup, and I'm moving forward. There may be some kind of proposal. This could be a knight in shining armor that's coming forward for you, okay? But I feel like there are definitely a lot of changes that are in store. There's a lot of things that this person really wants to say. They really want to take action upon. You know, and I feel like this person finds you very attractive. They find you very giving, very um, able to move forward, right? I feel like this person is ready. They're ready to make a move, okay? So let's go ahead and get a timeline for a Sagittarius. When will this connection happen? When will this connection happen? When it will go to this higher level? Give me a message for Sagittarius. When will this connection happen for Sagittarius? Okay. You are experiencing hesitation. Be clear with your desires. The time frame is within 10 months. Okay. At the bottom, we have 8 months. So once you get clear with your intentions, put your intentions out there, get clear, get a clear understanding of exactly what you want, Sagittarius, I feel like that 10 months is going to turn into 8 months, right? So let's go ahead and get your angel number. Let's see what's going on with Sagittarius. What does Sagittarius need to know right now for this connection? Give me a message for Sagittarius. Okay. Okay. 1111. Look at this. This is a connection. 1111. So intuition. Trust yourself, Sagittarius. Your inner whisper is working hard to let you know that it is guiding you. Listen in. What is it saying? Feel it. Where is it telling you to go next? See it. Close your eyes and allow. Trust the path that you're on. Okay? Your affirmation, Sagittarius, my intuition speaks to me and I listen. I trust that all things are happening for a purpose. Okay? So that is your reading, Sagittarius. Beautiful. I hope this helps you. 
If this resonates, please like and subscribe. If it doesn't resonate, take a look at your other placements. You can also take a look at your person's placements if you know them. Um, and many blessings to you, my beautiful Sagittarius. Love and light. Until your next reading.